Still no sign of the missing Massachusetts mom who's been missing since New Year's Day, but authorities say they have found more evidence and none of it bodes well. A search of a garbage dump has turned up clues that may be connected to Anna Walsh's disappearance. This while her husband remains behind bars, charged with hampering the investigation. Police searching for clues in the missing mom case say they discovered a hatchet buried in the garbage. 39-year-old Anna Walsh has been missing since New Year's Day. Her smirking husband, Brian Walsh, is charged with misleading police, but not with murder. In addition to the hatchet, Massachusetts police digging their way through the heap of garbage at a transfer station 15 miles from Walsh's mother's house also reportedly found evidence of blood, a hacksaw, a rug, and used cleaning products. Steve Cooper is a reporter for WHDH in Boston. Now all this possible evidence is being looked at by investigators and they're trying to sort of get a DNA profile here and determine whether these items are connected to the disappearance of Anna Walsh. The mystery of what happened to the mom of three is riveting America. Appearing on CNN this morning to talk about Inside Edition's 35th anniversary, Deborah was asked about the case. Across the board, the story that Brian Walsh has told investigators since his wife was last seen by someone outside the family has simply not added up to what the facts are that they're developing. Cops have also searched a dumpster at Walsh's mother's home. Walsh told police he drove there the day his wife was last seen. They did find a dumpster behind her condo complex. They seized that dumpster. Walsh only reported his wife Anna missing last Wednesday, three days after she was last seen. The missing woman's mother, who lives in Serbia, was quoted as saying her daughter reached out to her a week before her disappearance and begged her to fly to the USA and visit her. She just said, please, mama, come tomorrow, which means that clearly there must have been some problems. Brian Walsh was already on house arrest after being found guilty of fraud after selling two fake Andy Warhol paintings. He's currently awaiting sentencing in that case.